Hola, welcome to my channel. My name is Risa and this is Divine Portal. So today's video, I'm going to be channeling messages for my Aquarians. This could resonate if you have Aquarius in any of your placements. Please only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest for someone else. I hope all of you are doing well. I hope all of you had a wonderful time celebrating and bringing in this new year. So let's get into this reading. Also, I'm not taking any um, readings at the moment. I might take them in a, in a couple weeks, but for now, I'm just trying to get all the readings out to you guys who um, have already purchased one. So thank you for being patient with me. I appreciate you. So now let's see. What do we have for Aquarius here? What is the energy around Aquarius? We have remorseful and how could you? Hmm. Someone, someone is feeling remorseful for what they did. What can you tell me, Spirit, for Aquarius? What can you tell me for Aquarius? This one flipped over, so I'm gonna take this one. Scared to come forward. What can you tell me for Aquarius? What is the energy for Aquarius? We have home and hose mad. What else here? What else can you tell me about this energy around Aquarius? interesting anything else spirit for Aquarius on the bottom we have air signs Gemini Libra Aquarius we also have Aries Pierre and genuine no going back selfish Okay, let's see what we got here. Dying without you. Unhealthy connections. Screenshots, lying, speak up, commitment issues, sneaky, revengeful or vengeful, whatever you want to say, happy and peaceful, holding hands, Disgusted, hmm, toxic, I forgive my past, giving up, let me get one more from the top, I miss my family, okay, Okay, so there's someone that is afraid to come forward. They're afraid to reach out to you because they were lying. Maybe you found out. They're dying without you. They miss you. This is someone that's very, they could have been very toxic. They could have commitment issues. Maybe they did something very sneaky and disgusting. And maybe you, okay, with screenshots, sneaky, disgusted. It's like you could be... You could find out something about this person. Or it's like someone here is finding out something and they're like disgusted, you know. And the other person is like afraid to come forward because they know what they did. They, 
I feel like this person knows what they did, okay? Um, but they're missing you. It's, I don't know, this is very toxic energy. It's like all over the place. I see, what's interesting is I see that you're like happy, you're peaceful, and then all of this is going on around you. And someone wants you to, to reach out to them. Someone wants you to, it's like, well, maybe Aquarius will reach out to me first, you know? That way I won't have to, I don't know, they're like scared. They want to reach out, but they, I don't know. They're like, ah, what do I say, you know? It's like very anxious energy. I can feel the energy. Um, but yeah, you're happy, you're peaceful. This person could even be a little bit mad, like they want to get their revenge. Maybe they feel like they found out something about you. But it's like you're just chilling here. Um, if you have a family with someone, like you have kids with someone, I feel like they really miss you. They miss being together. There's like toxic. This person is toxic or there's toxic energy around here. If this is someone from your past, it's like... I feel like you're like, okay, I forgive you or I forgive the situation. Like, you're not holding on to it anymore. You're trying to just release that. I feel like you're, what's most important right now is just you being at peace, okay? And I feel like everyone around you or all this energy around you is, like, mad. Someone misses holding your hands. It's like someone could be holding on to you because they feel you giving up on them. But it's like you're letting go of these unhealthy connections, especially if you, you know, you're connecting to people who have commitment issues. It's like they know that you're a wonderful catch. They know that you're a wonderful woman or a man, but it's like they have these commitment issues. So it's like they keep fucking it up. They keep fucking up connections because it's like they have this toxic energy, you know? They, maybe they lied to you. Maybe they were hiding things. And now they lost you. Now they're dying without you. Now they're missing you. Let's see if we can get any new energy. Is there anyone new around Aquarius? Any new lovers? What can you tell me about new energy? We have Bitter Betty. What can you tell me about new energy? Anything new? Any new relationships? Connection? Ooh, we have a new job, so you could be focusing on work. You could be applying for a new job or starting a new business. What can you tell me about this new person, new energy? Ooh, we have meant to be. This new person, this new lover, it's meant to be. We have ego and pride. I'm good, love, go away. Some of you, okay. I feel like some of you, if you do find a new person or if a new person comes, some of you could be pushing this person away because either you're still hurt and bitter over this past person or maybe you have an ego or your pride is like pushing this person away or this could just be this past person trying to come in for a new a new start okay this came out i was trying to put that back in there but it says i'm getting you pregnant clingy and needy single and popping okay for those of you that are single you're looking good smelling good you're out here having fun or you're just out here living life getting money you know there is someone that's like plotting planning to get you pregnant, to sit you down. They don't like that you're out here looking good. They don't like that you're out here single and popping, okay? They're trying to hold on to you. They're clingy. They're needy. They need you. They don't want anyone else to have you, okay? So be careful with that. They're plotting. Especially if you walked away from them. They're like, oh, no. Yeah, return to sender. <laughs> Some of you are like, hell no. Return to sender. A new boo. Ooh, okay. 
So maybe this past person could feel like you're talking to someone new or you could find someone new. But I see this new boo coming either way and I feel like it's meant to be. What can you tell me about the new boo? Spirit, what can you tell me about this new boo? We have I fucked up. Hmm. Don't tell me the new person fucked up. And we have turning heads and breaking necks. So I feel like you're looking good. You got a lot of eyes on you, Aquarius. It could be more than just one person. It could be multiple people that have their eyes on you. I see you looking so good, Aquarius. Like, you're okay. Those of you that are single, I feel like you are attracting a lot of attention. When you go out, when you get dressed up, it's like, damn, people be breaking their necks to see you, especially if you got a big booty or, you know, they, you know, you know, when someone passes you and you have to turn around just to see if the booty's big, you know, <laughs> yeah, they're like, damn, okay, what else, <laughs> And this past person, whoever this is, they know they fucked up. They lost someone good, you know. Or if you're masculine, you know you're looking good, smelling good. Um, when you pass a group of women, they turn around. They're like, damn, he's fine, you know. Yeah, okay. What else? What else can you tell me? Ooh, okay. So first we have money issues, right? So some of you could be working on your money but then we have a millionaire in the making so i feel like some of you maybe you're not really focused on a relationship some of you could just be focusing on getting your money up you know um building your savings or you know just focusing on money instead of lovers or whatever right because sometimes if we're being honest like sometimes men or women or relationships they can distract us at times right so you got to remain focused yeah we have ha we have single and happy so i see a lot of beautiful energy we have happy peaceful single and popping single and happy so some of you are just okay with being single right now just focusing on your money focusing on your family and we have missing you yeah this person's missing you someone feels like how could you walk away how could you end this they feel like you're running from them yeah i feel like you're focused on other things right now and they're like okay aquarius i'm here focus on me i miss you i need you like hello i'm right here and you're like hmm just focusing on yourself i don't know but i feel like you're looking real good aquarius Whatever it is that you're doing, some of you could be working out. Some of you could be, you know, just putting more effort into your look, into just your energy, right? And I feel like whatever you're doing is working. You're attracting a lot of attention, even if you're not aware of it, you know? Okay. Let's see. Let me pull some money for you guys. Just some real quick money messages i rarely use these on my general on my general readings but i use these like in my um the personal readings i do so let's see what's the money looking like what's the money looking like for aquarius what messages do we have for them spirit please like the video if it's resonating oh what did i just say don't get distracted aquarius okay yeah, he's fine, but is he going to pay your bills? Yeah, so focus on your money. We have good credit. Some of you have really good credit or you're working on your credit. Follow your passion. So whatever you're passionate about, I feel like that could make you a lot of money. Ooh, money moves on the bottom. So you could be making some money moves. We have a broke mindset. Those of you that are struggling with your, your finances, I feel like it's all in your mindset, you know? You need to, to fix your mindset. We have a YouTube channel. Some of you could have a channel or you're thinking about getting a channel. I would say go for it, you know? Start your own business. What else do we have for Aquarius? Blocking the bag. 
What's blocking the bag, spirit? Invest in yourself. I feel like you could be distracted, you know, with people or just your mindset. Okay, that could be blocking your bag. Or maybe the fact that you need to invest in yourself, invest in your passions, okay? Don't be afraid to invest in yourself. Even if you lose the money, even if it doesn't work out, you just make more money, save more, and try it again, you know? It doesn't always happen on the first time. Like, you have to believe in yourself. We have artists. Some of you could be artistic, creative. Um, maybe think about selling your art, you know? What else, spirit? Ooh, we have scammer, thief, and a snake. Ooh, what else? What about that, spirit? Overworked. Some of you could be feeling overworked, or maybe there's someone that's trying to overwork you. There could be a scammer here trying to scam you out of your money, trying to take from you, okay? Be careful who you give your time and your energy to. We have a lot on my shoulder. Some of you could be the head of your household or you have a lot of shit, to, bills to pay, you know, shit to take care of, you know, and it becomes a lot to deal with. Start your own business. Athlete. Some of you could be an athlete. If you've been wanting to start your own business, I see that spirit is telling you to go for it, especially if you're passionate about whatever you're starting your business around. Invest in it. Invest in yourself. The best person to invest in is yourself, okay? Don't invest in these scammers or these people that are trying to, to get you to work with them, get you to start a business with them. No, do not give them any of your money, okay? Again, millionaire mindset. It's like, I see you making a lot of money. Some of you could have an OnlyFans, you know, whatever. However you make money, go for it, okay? Okay? We have government assistance. Some of you could be on government assistance, or maybe you need to apply for government assistance. Work smarter, not harder. What else, dude? Let me get two more. What talents can you make money from? So if you're very talented or creative, it's or, you know, whatever you're good at, can you make money from that? Or what can you make money from? It's like they need you to... They need you to start hustling, okay? Use your passions, your talents, okay? And we have Queen of Pentacles. One more. Overpaid, that's what I'm talking about. We want to be overpaid, right? <laughs> I'd rather be overpaid than underpaid, okay? Some of you are overworking yourself, okay? You need to figure out how can I work smarter and not harder, Okay? But yeah, I see you guys making lots of money. I see y'all being millionaires, okay? Saving money, building money, building wealth, okay? I love that for you. Be careful of like the brokies, the scammers, the dusties that, that want to live with you, want to borrow money from you, okay? Um, Now let's get into the love messages. Let's see what's good with the love. With the loving. What can you tell me about love? I just want to be next to you. Follow your passion. Again, Aquarius, follow your passion. No one can keep me away from you. I don't know what to do. Adult children. We have cancer. Aquarius. Buying you a ring. Let's get away together. We have Taurus. Girl boss. Let me use this other half now. 
What else can you tell me, spirit? Karma has been fucking me up. Ooh, someone's been getting fucked by karma. Please stop going back to them. Out of this world. What else can you tell me, spirit? We have Leo. Family obligations. Let me move this. Spooky and sexy. What else can you tell me about love for Aquarius? Power couple. I don't know how to express myself. Your silence kills me. I'm not going anywhere. How does this person feel about Aquarius? I love you. They love you, Aquarius. Using magic to keep you. Hmm. I miss your kisses. Obsessed ex. Holding your hand through the pain. And yeah, someone's casting spells. Ooh, someone's doing magic. And I'm thinking of you right now, Aquarius. Okay. Go, this person's thinking of you at this very exact moment, Aquarius. Okay, let's see. So, yeah, this person misses it. Okay, there's someone that misses you. And whoever this person is that misses you, they just want to be next to you. They want to kiss you. They want to hold you. You could be very silent right now. You know how we are, Aquarius. You could be giving them that silent treatment. Okay, it hurts. I'm hearing it hurts, Aquarius. They want to hear from you. They're like, baby, I miss you. What's wrong? Talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that's funny <laughs> and I feel like you're just like sitting back like yes beg me <laughs> okay but anyways yeah so they're like okay Chris I miss you I get it you're mad talk to me they love you they're not going anywhere okay they're like I'm not going anywhere Aquarius we're gonna work this out I'm buying you a ring. Marry me. Okay. We have Cancer, Taurus, Leo. It could be any sign. Okay. Um, if this is someone that has a family, let's just let's just get this over with. If this person has a family, Aquarius, they want to get away from their family. They want to come towards you. They feel like my family is not going to stop me from being with you, Aquarius. I want you. Okay. Yeah, I'm obligated to take care of them or obligated, you know, you know, I'm obligated in that situation, but I want to be with you. They can't keep me away from you. Let's get away together. Let's meet up. Okay. I'm also getting this person. They, okay. If they know that their family, them having a family is like a deal breaker for you, they're trying to like persuade you to stay you know yeah i have a family of course but we can make this work i feel like they're conflicted because they know that they have the family to take care of or whatever right but they want you they want you aquarius and they don't know what to do they're confused they're trying to figure out what they can do. Maybe if they get you a ring, you know, I don't know. And they also have a hard time expressing themselves, expressing what they're feeling, what they're thinking, what they're going through. Some of you could have children with someone. Maybe you have a family. I feel like your ex misses you, your baby daddy, your baby mama, they miss you, they want to be with you. And 
but there's someone that's like, please stop going back to that person. Either this is your spirits, your angels, you know, they're like, please stop going back to them, Aquarius. Or this could be someone else around you that wants you to stop going back to a certain person from your past or a certain person that they know is not good for you. They're like, I want to be with you. Stop going back to them, okay? I just heard, I'm the captain now. <laughs> Um, they love that you're very passionate. They love that you follow your passions. They love that you go after what it, whatever it is that you want. They love that if you put your mind to it, you're going to have it. They love that you're dedicated. They love that you're intelligent. They love that you love yourself and you're not going to settle. Okay? For those of you that are like, you have a family, I can't be with you. They stop talking. They're like, ooh, I love that shit. I love that you have morals. It makes me want you even more. <laughs> but it's like they can't they can't find you in anyone else. They can't get that same feeling from anyone else. Your energy is out of this world. You're an alien. You're like you're like one of one. Okay, this is why they love you. They love you, Aquarius. They're also afraid of you in a good way, in a sexy way. They feel like together you guys could be a power couple, especially, okay, if you're a woman and you're about your money, you're about your bag, they love that. They feel like together you guys could grow, you know, maybe even move in together. This could be a new person. Yeah, and I feel like whoever did you wrong, Aquarius, they're getting karma for that. Okay, karma is fucking them real good. Okay, not as good as you, but real good. Okay, so yeah, now let's get to the sexual messages. I am going to be pulling sexual messages if you're not interested in those type of messages or if you don't like explicit language you can click off now okay also if you're going through something this person is hold is wanting to hold your hand something about holding hands this person likes holding hands with you And you have an ex here that's obsessed with you also, Aquarius. They don't know how to let you go. This could be like an ex. This could be a new person. This could be another person. This could be multiple people. I, I don't feel like this is just one energy here, okay? Okay, how does this person feel about Aquarius sexually? What is the sexual energy around Aquarius? If you're single and celibate, what is the next sexual experience going to be like? What can you tell me, Spirit? Are they telling me? No, hold on. Let me use my other deck, actually. I'm getting caught with this other deck. What can you tell me? <laughs> you make me come so hard and rock hard. You make this masculine very hard. You make him come hard. Okay, what is the sexual energy like between Aquarius and this person? Okay, I'll put him to the side for now. What else, spirit? What else? How is this person feeling about Aquarius sexually? Tell me about the sexual energy. Oh, we have possessive over the pussy. What is the sexual?
special energy like a Aquarius. take those for now okay put them all in the same direction Again, you make me come so hard. Sexy moans. I can't hold it anymore. Creamy and juicy. We have buying pussy. Okay, someone could be buying pussy. It's loose, it's dry, it smells. <laughs> Kisses all over, or kiss me all over. Say my name. Nasty kisses. Extra sloppy. Crazy over the dick. And rock hard again. Okay. So first off, let me just say that there's someone here that buys pussy, okay? They hire prostitutes, sex workers, whatever you want to call it, okay? Whoever these women are that he's fucking, they're very loose, they, they're dry, they smell, they're like, not the best quality, I'm just going to say that, okay? It's like this person... This could be someone that you're not having sex with anymore or you're just not fucking with, okay? So they're buying pussy or they're, you know, they're entertaining other women, okay? Let's just say that. It's not the same. It's not the same quality. They miss you. They miss fucking you. It's like they're holding back. It's like they can't hold it anymore, Aquarius. They miss you. They need you. They miss the way you moan. They miss, they miss how, like, creamy you get, how wet you get. They like when you moan in their ear. Like, if you, if you guys are a fucking missionary. And you guys are, like, hugging at the same time. He, he misses that, okay? He misses kissing you. He, he wants to kiss you. He misses your kisses. He wants to, like, own you. He wants you to be crazy over the dick. Some of you could be crazy over the dick. Or he wants you to be crazy over the dick. Okay. You make him so hard. Let me get some more. Wait, which one is it? This one? No, it's not that one. This one. Yeah, you make him so hard. He wants you to he wants to like own you, like say my name, tell me that it's mine. What else can you tell me? Ooh, we have STDs. Mm. If he's out here buying pussy, I don't know. He doesn't even know where that pussy's been. I don't know. We have dirty dick. Yeah. I don't know, Aquarius. We have um, we have bored with my partner. Okay, say he's not buying pussy. Maybe he just has someone else, and it's like he's bored. It doesn't feel the same. It just he wants to put his tongue in it. Didn't I say he wants to own you? We have threesome with two men. You could have two men that are interested in you. What is the sexual energy that is between Aquarius and this person? We have just like that. Sit on my face. I miss the love that we made. Shaking orgasm and my dogs just shook. <laughs> Shaking orgasm. Someone wants to make you come. 
They want they want to eat you out while you sit on their face. They feel like you know exactly how to please them. We have watching porn. And we have sex addiction. Someone could be addicted to watching porn. We have pegging on the bottom. <laughs> Someone could be addicted to watching porn. Addicted to sex. Just like, I don't know, it's like this person can't. Okay, say you've already had sex with this person, okay? And then you cut you cut off sex, you're no longer talking to them, you're no long you're no longer having sex with them. It's like he's trying to get that feeling back again. The feeling that he had with you. And he's starting to realize that whoever he's fucking, it's like their pussies <laughs> I just heard mid. Their pussy's mid. I don't even say that. Their pussy's very mid. It's boring. They don't do it like you. You could be like really freaky or maybe this person is allowed to be freaky with you. Okay, what else before I let you go? Because it's too much. It's too much. We have coming to the thought of you and edging. So this person could masturbate to the thought of you while they're watching porn, but they like edge themselves. It's like they, I'm hearing even when they masturbate to the thought of you, it's still intense. We have tasty, only a hookup. They like the way you taste. Yes, making a way to masturbate. Say that this person's in a relationship, okay? Living with the person. They're like, all right, I'm going to go to the bathroom or I'm going to take a shower. Or he, like, finds a way or she finds a way to leave or sneak away so that they can masturbate to the thought of you. Even if it, okay, say you only hooked up with this person. It was like a one or one or two time thing, right? It wasn't anything serious. They can't stop thinking about it. They can't stop wanting it. They want to they want to make you come they feel like you gave them the best head ever or they want to give you the best head ever i don't know i'm just a messenger what signs are coming towards aquarius please like the video guys if it resonated subscribe if you're new to my channel what can you tell me who's coming towards aquarius We have Gemini, um, Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Taurus, Pisces, Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Aquarius, Capricorn, Virgo, who else? We have Libra, Virgo, Taurus, Libra. I just heard I'm horny. <laughs> Someone's horny. Sagittarius, Pisces, Leo, and Libra. Of course, it could be any sign. These are just the ones that are coming out the strongest right now. Um, this could be signs that they have in their chart. They could be signs that you have in yours. Whew. I feel like this was a roller coaster, Aquarius. Thank you for being with me. Thank you for, for everything. I appreciate all of you. I love all of you. I will let, if you're interested in a personal reading, I will let you guys know whenever I start accepting them again. I love all of you. Enjoy the rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of this beautiful new year. I love you. Bye.